Hello everyone. I've got another game here. Uh, so this one, we have Throne as the village. We have Gear Conspirator looks pretty good. Baron and Ranger for plus buy. I'm thinking Gear Baron looks pretty good. Um, yeah, I definitely like that as the open. Um, gear and Toil both kind of mitigate terminal collision risk, so that doesn't seem to be too much of a concern. Uh, I've got six here, probably going to get a Cobbler. I mean, there's a lot of good stuff for Cobbler to gain, like Thrones, Conspirators, Rangers, lots of, lots of good stuff. Um... Next turn, I potentially have another five if I see the gear. Um, okay, I don't see the gear, um, which isn't great, but it's not the worst thing that's ever happened to us. Um, thinking about a conspirator or um, a throne room here. I mean, what's the alternative? Like another gear? I mean, I guess that worst throne is like a way of the monkey. I think I'll get the throne. Um, yeah, I mean, it's not totally clear, but it seems like it could work out. Okay, yeah, like this, I don't think this is great. Um, Because, like, if I set aside throne baron, that's... Like, there's only one estate down there, so that doesn't really seem that impressive. I think I set aside Baron Estate. I mean, I guess I could, like, gain a, a Conspirator next turn. And then, like, you throw in the Conspirator. I think I like setting aside Baron Estate, though. Um, yeah, and now, like, I can gain... I can, like, gain another throne. Yeah, I'm gonna just get lots of, lots of money. Um, so this could be, like, Cobbler, Conspirator gear, maybe. I mean, I think two Cobblers is pretty reasonable. Um, I guess I could also add a Ranger at some point. Maybe that point should be now. Mm. Mm. Cop or a conspirator or ranger. What do I want? Mm. I think I like the conspirator. Mostly my concern with ranger is like, I don't know, I feel like it doesn't really play very well with throne at this stage of the game. Uh, I'll set aside nothing with this and then just set aside with the next one. Okay, so I can just, like, set aside this. Maybe I get the ranger now. Um, yeah, makes sense. Okay. I think we... I think we're gonna gain a throne. I mean, it would be a bit nicer if I could, like, throne throne a conspirator, because then they both activate, but... Yeah, I mean, this is okay, too. Uh, yeah, we can just toil this Baron, I think. Oh, I can even toil the throne on Baron. That looks pretty nice. Um, so, like, if I toil throne, I'd have, like, 11 if I set aside two coppers, which could be, like, year two more thrones, maybe? Sure. Um, I mean, it could be two thrones where I could take another four. Kind of tempted by another conspirator. Eh, I think I like it. I mean, I, I want to have things. I want to make sure I have enough, uh, like, throne targets rather than just a million thrones. 
Oh, interesting. Okay, yeah, like you can play the conspirator as monkey first. Um, I mean, I don't think I like necessarily should have done that. Like, yeah, I mean, I ended up throwing a baron, so I had plenty of buys. So, I guess for me, it was it, it worked out fine. Um, yeah, so definitely gonna take a throne here because then. Yeah, like this, we can just activate the Conspirator twice, which is really nice. Um, it's going to be pretty sad if I don't get some plus by this turn. I will set aside like this, though. Okay. Yeah. Uh, so this is like 11, if I set aside um, Estate Copper, which seems pretty natural. And then I think I take like the last throne plus a conspirator, maybe. I mean, I could also take like another ranger. Um, I think I like the conspirator better than the ranger. Okay. So this looks pretty nice. Um. You need to figure out if there's a conspirator down there, I think. Um, I don't I don't think I like that mystic. Um so I have three. Uh yeah, so there is a conspirator down there, in which case I think I would rather gain Ranger. I mean, I could also get, like, another Baron, but it seems a bit greedy. Yeah, I think another Ranger makes sense. Uh, the reason I don't like Mystic... Like, I, I think Mystic is just, like, wor a worse card than Conspirator. Um, even ignoring the cost. Um, okay. So then we're gonna Throne. Uh, I think I could just throw in the Conspirator now. Like, I don't... I think I'm running out of actions this turn. Um, I need to figure out how many thrones I have too, because I'd really like to throw in a Baron. Um, two, three, four, five, six. Right, and my, yeah. Yeah, I have six thrones total. So I can throw in this Conspirator. There's still another throne for the Baron, ideally. Yeah. Yeah, okay. So this last card's a throne. Um, I think I can, yeah, just set aside a lot of stuff. I mean, yeah, setting aside a bunch of cards should help a, a good bit with deck control. So I think I like doing that. And I think I'm I'm ready to green at this point. Um, I mean, 24 could even just be triple province. Although maybe some number of conspirators is better. And there is Silk Roads. So there's a bit of alt VP on the board. Um, hmm. So if I go triple, it's not really clear I'll be able to triple again. I think I like double and double conspirator a bit better than triple province. Because I think this puts a bit of pressure on piles. Um, I at least don't think my opponent could ever pile this turn. I mean, the thing is that I, I do have the points lead, so they would need to go like... I mean, what, Gears and Conspirators, and then, like, Province of State or something? Or maybe they could go out on Estates, but I, I don't know. I, I just don't think their deck is that good. Maybe I should have put, given it more thought than I did, but... Oh, also, like, this is a terrible hand, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, this hand is actually pretty scary. Because what like 
I throw in a conspirator and then I draw like one card. And then I kind of just have to hope to draw another throne. Which, I mean, there's like five more thrones down there, so I guess it's not, yeah, it's not like that unlikely. Although, yeah, it is It is a little bit of an awkward hand, because I do end up playing a conspirator uh, just as a, a terminal silver, which, of course, isn't great. Um, okay. Um... Now, if this turn isn't a dud, I might be able to pile, right? Because if I can just go, like, so what? If I, I gain the Conspirator, and then what? I would need to, like, Province, Conspirator, Triple Gear. That costs, like, 21. Yeah, that's not so bad. I mean, I had 24 last turn. Get another Conspirator. So, yeah, it seems pretty doable. But I do need to, I do need to have a Throne near the top. Um, if I do not get a throne, yeah, this is just a dud. That's quite unfortunate, for sure. Um, yeah, like, I mean, I guess, if I, like, play the ranger now, I wonder if I could, like, play out kind of a partial turn just with toil, like toiling and chaining a bunch of thrones. Maybe? I mean, I think I'd just do it. I mean, I could also throne the ranger. I think that's less good, though. Okay. So yeah, like here, you just toil the throne. Probably throning the throne. I... So how much does so I said I need 21 to uh to get there. Um like 21 and 5 buys. I guess like 20 and 6 buys would also do it with Duchy Estate. Um So okay, so like if I just throned the Baron here, I'd have well, that's 20 and... or no, not... that's 20... 22? Yeah, so I think this is actually, like, getting there pretty easily. So, Throne, Throne, Baron... Um... Yeah, I, I probably took longer doing this than I really needed to, but... Um... Yeah, so we just, like, monkey all this stuff. And then that's game. Okay, yeah, that, that was kind of cool how I was, I was able to win off of uh, pretty much a dud there. Um, but, uh, yeah, thanks for, uh, thanks for watching, everyone. Bye.